Another great way to start off your New Year's is with my next guest this morning. She's a seasoned jazz singer who will blow you away once you hear her perform. She's received so many wonderful reviews from many influential jazz singers and publications, some of the most influential publications and singers in the nation, in fact. Now, if you can't catch her on New Year's Eve, you can catch her just a few weeks later in concert at the Truman Little White House. Libby, it is a pleasure having you with me this Thank morning. Thank you, Jenna. It's a pleasure to be here. Now, Libby, are you happy to be back in Key West and be performing, in fact, this New Year? It's always wonderful to come home to Key West. And uh, yes, there's so many great, uh, exciting events happening this season. So uh, I'm really looking forward to doing some very special concerts and uh, performing with some great uh, musicians. Libby, how many years ago did you move to Key West? Oh, gosh, uh, many, <laughs> many. So I have a lot of history on the island, and uh, it's just a wonderful place. And you split your time between here and where's the other place? Well, I'm, I'm in New York a lot, and I'm actually in Paris quite a bit these days, uh, mm -hmm. performing there. And uh, so uh, wherever the work takes, takes me, mm -hmm. you know. That's where you go. Have well. voice, will travel. Mm -hmm. Well, we're so fortunate. <laughs> to have you here. And Libby, I understand that you just finished up a show at the Metropolitan Room in New York. How yes, we did um, with wonderful musicians, Warren Vache on cornet and John Martino on piano, a great New York musicians. And we um, got the first uh, two recording sessions going for a new uh, album, which will be out sometime in 2013. So okay. uh, that's uh, exciting. So you have a lot ahead for you. Libby. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's an exciting year. And now let's talk for a minute about the Truman Little White House concert. I know that this is something big that you've been preparing for for a while. Yes. And you're very excited about who you're performing with. I am. T I have a uh, guitarist, Howard Alden, who is, a, you know, uh, a world-renowned jazz guitarist. He did the music for Woody Allen's um, movie Sweet and Low Down, and among many other things. He's on my uh, most recent CD called Here With You. He did the arrangements for that. And uh, he's never been to Key West before, so it's a chance for Key Westers to hear someone who, who uh, normally we might not be able to get him down here, but mm -hmm. this is a very special event, January 14th and 15th. Well, hopefully he falls in love with Key West so that we can get I back I hope again. so. <laughs> we, we've worked together in the Bahamas, and I know he loves beautiful warm weather, and. Mm -hmm and beautiful water, so I hope we'll get him back again. Libby, have you always been doing jazz music? Uh, I started a little bit late in my life, but I've been doing it for quite a while now, so, mm -hmm. um, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's what I love, and it's a blessing to have a, a job that you love mm -hmm. uh, to do. Is it challenging, though, Libby, being in such a male-dominated music industry? It, it is, as, as I'm sure you know as well. Um, you learn to kind of uh, roll with the punches and um, just kind of smile and do things your own way, you mm -hmm. know. Mm -hmm. Do you have a concert or a performance that is most memorable to you, Libby? Something you just can't forget? Oh, boy. Good question. I think this last um, performance in Paris was very exciting. It was Café Laurent in this beautiful uh, hotel in Saint-Germain-de-Prés and uh, with the Christian Brenner Trio. And we had a full, full house, and it was just a wonderful evening. So um, that's always exciting to, to uh, play in Paris. Any more trips scheduled there? Yeah, we're going in April. I'll, I think I'll be back uh, uh, at the same cafe, and, uh, you know, it's such a beautiful place. It's mm -hmm. great to be there. Now, with the new year upon us, Libby, do you have some goals? for 2013? Mm, New Year's resolutions. New Year's resolutions, <laughs> right? Definitely finishing the new CD is a, is a big one. Um, I'll be going back to New York to, to uh, do the mixing and mastering, and it'll be out uh, at some point in the new year. So that's, that's a big one. And the concerts in Key West. Uh, we're, uh, I've got four of them at the Little White House, two in January and two in March, and then a concert called To Paris with Love at the Studios of Key West coming up in February. And, um, and closer uh, to, to uh, our date now, December 27th, uh, Music in Paradise is doing a beautiful event at the, uh, the oldest house. So um, 
I, I hope people will stay in touch at uh, LibbyYork.com, and all the information is there. So. Okay, and your schedule is there as well. The schedule so. is there, and people can email me if they have questions, or uh, um, definitely love to hear from people. and, and uh, Hopefully they can make your contacts, Libby. I look forward to them. And we can't forget that you do have one on New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve at Cafe Soleil. That's our steady Sunday brunch uh, spot. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'll be there on New Year's Eve with Bobby Nesbitt on piano and vocals. Uh, Key Westers know Bobby. He's wonderful. Mm -hmm. And we'll be doing a great American songbook favorites. And Bobby knows all the songs. So anything anyone requests, we can usually pull out of the hat. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, Yes, New Year's Eve, that'll be fun. Well, the two of you together, you have to be an amazing, amazing pair. So. Well, thank you. It's, it's so much fun to be able to do duets. Mm -hmm. And, uh, of course, Bobby's great at that. And those lyrics, I don't know. So, um, <laughs> you and balance all of, each other out. I think so. <laughs> and uh, he does wonderful things uh, with uh, Carmen Rodriguez also, mm -hmm. who's a dear friend. But uh, it's a treat for me to be able to work with Bobby. Wonderful. Well, it was a treat for me this morning to have you on the show. So thank you. Thank you, Jen. It was a pleasure. With you there, they never the west and north and south. They're both the best. But I would only go there as a guest. Cause I love being here with you. I love the sea. I love the shore. I love the rocks. And what is more, 